Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to flash from 5.0.2 Android Lollipop to 5.1 uh, Android Lollipop on a Samsung Galaxy S2 device. So this phone, uh, it's a uh, GTI 9100. It's running unofficial version, uh, let me show you. It's a running unofficial version 12, uh, 12. so running Android 5.0.2 obviously. Uh, it was developed by Lee Serzik as it here and uh, he has released a 5.1 version of the Android Lollipop so uh, before we get started I, need, I want to show you what are the files uh, uh, you need to you need to keep it keep that file on uh, you know uh, uh, external memory card so uh, I have made a folder here CM12 as you can see so CM12 and I have also kept the uh, I have downloaded the CM12.1 unofficial version over here and obviously you need gapps so 5.1 gapps uh, 5.0.2 gapps will not work so yeah now let's get started uh, let's turn off the phone and by the way this phone is wor was working perfectly on 5.0.2 without any bugs uh, sometimes it might lag but no worries so let's uh, shut down uh, after you back up and all all those stuffs you need to go to recovery mode so don't forget to back up so as you can see it is turned off now I need to reboot to recovery mode so to boot onto recovery mode you need to press the uh, power button over uh, no not the power button the volume up button volume up button then the home button and then the power button over here so three buttons at a time at uh, same time so for the let's go it press it one two three go so first of all Samsung Galaxy S2 will come then it will go then you don't uh, don't uh, don't just leave it just press on and second time also it does that and okay so uh, yeah now we have reached the recovery mode as you can see now let's uh, I'll show you how to put it so uh, first of all you need to wipe the factory, factory reset so CM base recovery for 6.0.5.1 you need this because you can't flash it with other uh, CMW base recovery so let's wipe data factory reset yes I want to flash I want to wipe so wipe it formatting data alright done uh, now I need to ca clear <coughs> cache cache partition I also need to wipe cache partition yes so cache partition uh, wiping cache yes wipe cache power button is used to you know uh, say accept so uh, now I need to go to advanced and uh, here advanced and wipe data cache you don't need to do this but I'm just saying you know now after that go back and after that go to install zip so you go to install zip now choose from SD card one because the external uh, SD card one is your external for external SD card. I have made a folder called CMW uh, CM12. So let's go there. Now you need to flash CM12.1 zip file. So it it is going to take long time. Don't worry. Yes, I want to install. Let's do this. Don't worry, uh, it is going to take some really long time, uh, about like you know three to four minutes, five minutes probably. Mm -hmm. So let's hold it up and it will not show any progress bar right now because uh, I don't know why. So at the last moment, uh, like before two to three seconds, it will just go through like this. Okay, so let's wait. let's wait it 
it's taking longer than usual um, but still let's hope for the best well look look it's complete so I said you right before two to three seconds the progress bar is going to you know get uh, okay so so now uh, you get to this um, choose chip from again SD card 1 uh, over here CM12 then now GS 5.1 X uh, I'll, I'll post a link for that too uh, you can see here so okay let's install this okay G apps hopefully it will install 5.0.2 G apps is not going to work because uh, uh, because uh, I don't know why <laughs> and 5.1 works and for 5.1 so yeah it's um, SD card complete so let's go back let's go back come on octopus let's go back now let's uh, wipe cache partition uh, let's go wipe cache partition now we just need to reboot system let's do this okay finally done uh, fix root yeah of course I want to fix root okay so it's it's going to reboot oh sorry 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 so it's going to reboot uh, and it should run 12.1 size and mode on Samsung Galaxy S2. Well, it does seem, uh, I don't know, same. going to take some time so let's be patient anyways guys uh, you should go to XTA developer forum and download the file uh, I'll post a link below in the description um, so let's wait well guys finally it took about five to eight minutes uh, so let's go through the process I'll skip skip anyway why is this cup keeping on repeating okay just a sec wow the battery did took some serious seriously uh, skip anyway okay so skip uh, okay next okay next okay start wow okay so we have installed 12.1 cm version uh, technically completely so yep I get it so there is nothing in the well it looks good it looks more bigger uh, I don't know how well okay so this is the new feature yes uh, the Wi-Fi is here only you don't need to go inside there and Bluetooth also yep so I think some some stuffs are really cool the protect mode this is also kind of a uh, different changed one 
Uh, so let's go and see uh, about phone. So unofficial 12.1, 5.1. Yes, yay! All pop. I never played this, but I like it. Oh, come on! All right, so uh, yep, Th that's it's like similar. Oh wait a minute, this is quite bold. So what? <laughs> I mean, it just felt like it was bold. I don't know. I don't remember. Uh, but it might be, maybe. So guys, look how smooth it is. We can even make the larger icons. So yes, well we have finally uh, booted up, and this is this much for now. So I'll post a review video on next uh, video. So be be sure to check that out and please subscribe and comment. Uh, so this much is guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.